Greetings of peace and prosperity. I am Bismarck E. Makatigib, a third-year student taking a Bachelor of Secondary Education major in Math at North Sushatun Campus. Today, I am going to discuss Unit 3, Phases and Process of Curriculum Development, particularly on Curriculum Evaluation. Objectives At the end of the discussion, the students are able to Define Curriculum Evaluation Demonstrate the significance of curriculum evaluation for improved quality learning and appreciate the need of curriculum evaluation in the process of curriculum development. Before we proceed to our main discussion, let us first define curriculum and evaluation. Curriculum refers to the lessons and academic content taught in a school or in a specific course or program. It is also a standards-based sequence of planned experiences where students practice and achieve proficiency in content and applied learning skills. On the other hand, evaluation is defined as a process of judging or calculating the quality, importance, amount, or value of something. Evaluation is also defined as a collection of analysis and interpretation of information about any aspect of a program of education or training as part of a recognized process of judging its effectiveness, its efficiency, and any other outcomes it may have. Curriculum Evaluation is a set of measurement procedures that use direct observation and a recording of a student's performance in a specific curriculum to gather information. Evaluation of curriculum is an integral and essential part of the whole process of curriculum development. It is a continuous activity and not a tail end process. Curriculum evaluation is a significant tool in determining the merits and worth of a particular curriculum from the time it was conceptualized, planned, organized, and implemented. At this point in time, let us proceed to the definitions of curriculum evaluation. According to Ornstein and Hunkins, 1998, curriculum evaluation is a process done in order to gather data that enables one to decide whether to accept, change, or eliminate the curriculum. It is also defined as a formal process of determining the quality, effectiveness, or value of a curriculum. Lastly, it is defined as a process to gather and interpret the data coming from an existing curriculum. The term evaluation generally applies to the process of making a value judgment. In education, the term evaluation is used in reference to operations associated with curricula, programs, interventions, methods of teaching, and organizational factors. Curriculum evaluation aims to examine the impact of implemented curriculum on student achievement so that the official curriculum can be revised if necessary and to review teaching and learning processes in the classroom. Curriculum evaluation establishes specific strengths and weaknesses of a curriculum and its implementation, critical information for strategic changes and policy decisions, inputs needed for improved learning and teaching, and lastly, indicators for monitoring. The ultimate goal of curriculum evaluation is to ensure that the curriculum is effective in promoting improved quality of student learning. Curriculum evaluation may be an internal activity and process conducted by the various units within the education system for their own respective purposes. 
these units may include national ministries of education, regional education authorities, institutional supervision and reporting systems, departments of education, schools, and communities. Curriculum evaluation may also be external or commissioned review processes. This may be undertaken regularly by special committees or task forces on the curriculum, or they may be research-based studies on the state and effectiveness of various aspects of the curriculum and its implementation. These processes might examine, for example, the effectiveness of curriculum content, existing pedagogies and instructional approaches, teacher training and textbooks and instructional materials. Curriculum evaluation is a necessary and important aspect of any national education system. It provides the basis for curriculum policy decisions, for feedback on continuous curriculum adjustments and processes of curriculum implementation. The fundamental concerns of curriculum evaluation relate to effectiveness and efficiency of translating government education policy into educational practice, status of curriculum contents and practices in the context of global, national, and local concerns, and lastly, the achievement of the goals and the aims of educational programs. And now, let us proceed to our conclusion. Curriculum evaluation is a process done in order to gather data that enables one to decide whether to accept, change, or eliminate the curriculum. Curriculum evaluation is an essential phase of curriculum development. Through evaluation, a faculty discovers whether a curriculum is fulfilling its purpose and whether students are actually learning. And that ends my report. Thank you for listening and have a great day ahead.